Greenland, summer 2011. A team of scientists from US and UK records and witnesses the birth and death of a superglacial lake named Lake Ponting. The lake filled in five days, reaching depths of about six meters and an extent of about 1.5 kilometers. Yeah, there's still there should be, and it was flowing out like. Time lapse cameras and sensors in the lake recorded the fast no. and violent drainage oh, that occurred in about one hour. I think we should go grab the sensors, the transducers. But if you grab it, I can. Uh, unless you exchange it. The lake drained no, through the bottom of a monster moulin about 10 meters in diameter. After the drainage, the water was roaring into the Mulan in all its fury and power. An aerial view from a remotely controlled helicopter shows the large ice and snow blocks that were lifted during the drainage. Each of these blocks can weigh as much as three fire trucks. The water in the Mulan is transported through the ice by means of inglacial channels, which develop during the melting season as a web of liquid water, much stronger than harder ice. A second Mulan was found along a crack cutting through the bottom of the lake. The larger Mulan was not active after a few days as the water flowing into it reduced. But the younger Mulans were still swallowing water coming from other directions. After a few days, an apparent calm pervaded the bottom of the lake. The water had found his path through the ice to flow to the ocean and accelerating the flow of the ice towards the coast.